to just exfoliate and I'm being generous with it just so you guys could see it on the skin so just exfoliate the skin circular motion Hi guys welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video today is a wonderful facial scrub this is an anti-aging facial scrub this is gonna get rid of wrinkles and fine lines and sagging skin now the wonderful thing about this scrub is that if you have rough dry looking skin this is an amazing scrub for you this is not only gonna get rid of the wrinkles but it's also gonna shrink those pores it's gonna clean the dead skin cells from the surface of the skin clean those pores out and after cleaning those are gonna shrink and before you know it you're on your way to bright beautiful radiant glowing skin so if you're interested in today's video come with me to the kitchen and I'll show you how to whip this up in no time our first ingredient is rice and I'm using white rice use whatever rice you have and rice has been used for centuries in skincare rice is gonna help to tighten and firm the skin it's gonna brighten that skin and it's gonna leave your skin soft and supple you can choose to use the rice or you can choose to use rice water on the skin now rice is loaded with antioxidant that is great for your skin now if you use rice on a regular it definitely will help your skin to look younger fresher brighter and radiant our next ingredient is baking soda and baking soda is a great exfoliator for the skin it will help to get rid of the spots the blemishes it will clean those pores out and help to shrink them it will also get rid of acne it will get rid of the dead skin cell and it leave your skin just soft supple and clean looking our next ingredient is green tea and I'm using a tea bag if you have loose leaf go ahead and use that green tea is loaded with antioxidant vitamins and minerals that is great for the skin it is a perfect anti-aging ingredient it's gonna help to get rid of wrinkles and fine lines and it's also gonna help to lift and firm the skin when mixed with the other ingredient our final ingredient is coconut oil and choose the coconut oil of your choice now coconut oil is very moisturizing to the skin coconut oil will also help to clear the skin of spots and blemishes now when mixed with the other ingredient coconut oil is gonna have your skin also looking clean clear soft supple and just fresh and young looking now the first thing I'm gonna do I'm gonna prepare the rice by blending so you're gonna blend this to a powder and here we have our blended rice and take a look at it this is how you need it to be to a powder okay so now that we have all the ingredients ready we're gonna put them together so the first thing I'm gonna do I'm gonna use my tea bag and I'm using the entire tea bag which is about one teaspoon full if you do not have green tea you can also choose to use white tea next I'm moving on to our rice and I'm using a tablespoon of blended rice one teaspoon of baking soda and now we're gonna mix the dry ingredient together make sure to get rid of any lump that the baking soda might have so just mix well and as you can see the baking soda tend to get a little lumpy at times so just break the lumps up let me use a spoon to do this one and this is now good this is exactly how you need it to look take a look at it 
this is how you need the mixture to look now once we have all the dry ingredients blended together we're now going to move on to adding our coconut oil so I'm using about a, a tablespoon of coconut oil if you're using the liquid use two tablespoons and now we're going to slowly mash this in the dry ingredient you are not going to add any water to this okay it's going to look a little dry when you just start it take your time it's going to melt nicely okay so just blend and you do not need more coconut oil this is just fine just be patient okay And as you can see, this is coming nicely a lot. It's actually wonderful. Now, this is one scrub that you could make and keep for a while. You can keep this scrub up to a month. There's actually nothing in this scrub that is going to spoil fast. You can choose to keep it in the refrigerator or you can choose to keep it on your countertop. And now, the scrub is ready take a look at it up close and let's test it this is how you want it to be very soft very nice a perfect facial scrub so next I'm gonna go on the other side and I'm gonna show you how to use this wonderful facial scrub on your skin for best result so here we have our coconut baking soda green tea scrub and we're just gonna mix this up and this amount can last you about three to four times okay because a little goes a long way so you want to mix just before you use and this actually get better with age because once you put this down the green tea is gonna infuse in the other ingredient and it's gonna be more potent okay now before you apply this facial scrub remember that you need to start with clean skin so you're just gonna wash your face just get rid of any form of a makeup that you might be wearing and then you are ready to exfoliate the face you're gonna take a little bit in your hands not a lot and you're just gonna rub it in the hands like this and the oil is gonna melt because you're warming it up okay and once it is warmed you're gonna use it to exfoliate the skin I'm gonna use it in just a half a side of my face today so just exfoliate and I'm being generous with it just so you guys could see it on the skin so just exfoliate the skin circular motion don't forget the nose Now this exfoliator is actually good not only for your face but is also great for the neck and decollete area. You can basically use this on your entire body. I personally like to use it to exfoliate my hands also. If your hands are looking old and rough and need a pick me up, use this to exfoliate your hands. Now after you exfoliate with this exfoliator, I would suggest that you sit with it on the skin for a couple of minutes. Probably about five to ten minutes and let it just soak in the skin now after that you're gonna rinse off with some warm water after rinsing you're gonna pat dry and then you're gonna move on to the next step which is to apply your favorite facial toner your favorite serum or your favorite moisturizer now continue to use this facial scrub at least two to three times per week for best result. Now play around with the base ingredient. Now I use green tea. You can choose to use some avocado. You can choose to use some papaya in this. Just mix the ingredient with other stuff and apply it in your skin. And you're going to be amazed at the wonderful result you get from using this facial scrub. Okay, so continue to use it as I said before two to three times per week and you're on your way to bright clear radiant 
glowing right. look so there you have it thank you all for watching if you like the video give it a thumbs up don't forget to share the video and leave your comments and if this was the first time watching look below you're gonna see the word subscribe just click on it and you will be subscribed thank you all for watching and i'll see you in my next video Bye bye